The Emsoil Championship Snowcross Series is brought to you by Piranha X. And by Traxxas. As the rain pours down on Lake Geneva, snowcross racer Bobby LePage welcomes the challenge. I'm Bobby LePage, I'm 26 and I race professional snowmills. I started racing snowmills when I was 11, got into snowcross when I was like 12 or 13. Oh yeah, for sure, when you're standing on top of the, the tabletop for intros and, and they're screaming your name all over the loud mic and stuff. You know, I still get I still get the butterflies in my stomach. You no, know, Bobby LePage, what an opportunity for him. He's been racing for years. He's had great success. He was a great semi-pro, race pro out east last year. Now he's here in the big time. It isn't any any easier to win here. It's actually much easier to lose here. And this is a problem for Bobby LePage. Came out a little short. Yeah, I tried a different line and it shot me into the wall. Uh, coming in, in the last corner before the finish line. So we bent up the handlebars, went down pretty good. Um, just get it back together. Hopefully we don't have to go on an LCQ. Uh, I got up and finished that race, so I think I got like a 2-4 like or 2-5 to go into this uh, next race. Uh, the season's been uh, up and down. Hopefully we can build on for next year. You know, basically this is my uh, rookie year in pro class. So, so I'm making all them rookie mistakes. So it's always building. Every weekend you're building. Building confidence, building speed, building building everything. My goal this weekend for Lake Geneva is to go out, get a go to hole shot, and make some noise. Uh, season's been treating me awesome. I think I was on the podium every weekend, but uh, maybe one or two two races total. I think. Uh, it's been a blast. I mean, it's never a dull moment. There's always a battle taking place, and you never know what's going to happen next. There's some things going in Ross Martin's way this weekend. One, this is just what he calls his home track. It's close to where he lives. He's got a lot of fans, a lot of family that are going to be here cheering for him. Two, he won here last year. He won a Pro Open Championship here last year. He knows what's required on this racetrack. I just feel confident about this weekend. It's a bigger track. You can find your own lines and uh, make up a lot of time quick. It's, uh, it's one of the toughest, it is the toughest track we have. All season long, Tucker has been stalking Ross Martin. He's been stalking the guy that was the reigning points champion. Tucker would come up, get him at the end of the race, go by him. He's done a great job of, of finding him, hunting him down, getting the job done at the end of the race. Now it's role reversal. I love role playing. Now Ross Martin is going to be stalking Tucker. I think Tucker Hibbert has made me a better racer now to be up there battling with him is just unbelievable and uh, it does make you want to push to the next step and get up on top. Now I'm not only battling with him, I want to beat him. Round one, Bobby LePage lines up against Ross Martin and Tim Tremblay for the first Pro Open race of the day. Right out of the gate, Martin and Brett Turcott battle for the whole shot. Martin takes the lead with Turka, Garth Kaufman, and Tim Tremblay trailing behind. LePage falls back into seventh place. Lap two, Martin begins to distance himself from the pack. Tremblay falls back into fourth. <laughs> Yesterday's Pro Stock winner, Tim Tremblay, makes a move and passes Kaufman for third. As Tremblay surges ahead, Martin lengthens his lead out front. Meanwhile, 
Bobby LePage continues to struggle mid-pack. Martin continues dominating the race. Tremblay battles with Turcotte for second. As the checkered flag flies, Ross Martin captures the win, followed by Tremblay in second. Both riders have guaranteed themselves a place in the last race of the season, the Pro Open Final. When we return, veteran rider Robbie Malinowski takes to the track. Can number four take a win? Or does Tucker Hibbert have other plans? We'll find out.